So, chemistry has come to Minecraft, at least the education edition, which has a whole load of great features and is designed for teaching, uh, using Minecraft to teach in the classroom. And it's been a great pleasure working with Microsoft and John Mills from iLearning UK to develop this world to sh that shows off some of the features of the new chemistry update. So here we go. Um, one of my favorite the main thing is that we've got these four new sort of tables in Minecraft. Uh, we'll start with this one. This is the element constructor. Now, all you do is you add together the right number of protons, electrons, and neutrons, and you can make elements. The nice thing about it as well is that you can um, create isotopes as well so there we go we can we can add in a neutron and make deuterium you can of course make any element you like by adding together the right number of electrons and protons there we go right uh what what else should we make there we go how about some nitrogen right there we go uh, there's a really there's another really nice way you can access any of the um, a whole load of elements as well and that's by using this device here which is the material reducer so if you take a block from minecraft so some of the basic building blocks for example we can get some dirt uh, let's get some wood or some ores how about uh, how about some iron ore there we go and you drop that those blocks then into the mirror material reducer you get the an approximate elemental composition of those um blocks right so we've got some iron there let's get the nitrogen that might be handy in a minute and uh calcium excellent right now we can also add a let's put wood in for example and there we go we get carbon hydrogen oxygen and nitrogen out let's get, grab the carbon and the oxygen right now you can also we're going to need some um, you can also if you prefer if you're in the creative mode you can just grab all the elements you need from down here as well but they're all there all of them are nicely updated so we've got the we've got the latest uh, additions to the periodic table down here uh, I just might need a bit of chlorine for something in a minute I'll grab some of that right now um, over here then what we have are also something called the compound creator so you can take uh, elements let's put some Let's make calcium chloride, for example, and boom, there we go. We get some of that. Oh, I also want some potassium for something else I want to show you. There we go. So we can make uh, calcium chloride, we can make potassium chloride, and a whole load of other things. Where's my chlorine gone? Ooh, I've lost the chlorine. Uh, oh, there it is. Okay chloride you know, we can make uh, we can oh, whilst I'm here I'll show you some of the other things you can make five six and we need some hydrogens five, six there we go look well, guess what that is benzene of course right now we've got here also a, a, a lab table so we can add, add some of the chemicals together to make new stuff there as well oh, actually let's knit back over here and let's make some um, let's make some ammonia so for example if we take some ammonia and add in a bit of phosphorus in our table now we can see the lab table is making something there uh, this animation tells us that we hit combine Ooh, something's created and in this case it is something called uh, super fertilizer so you can go and add that to your crops and see what happens all right there's there's also more functionality added to the crafting table so if we take some um some sticks for example there we go and uh a stick and we need some 
need some magnesium. A bit of magnesium and a uh, some calcium chloride. We now get an orange sparkler. So these sparklers are new. And the nice thing about these is that the color of the sparkler uh, is approximates the color of the flame test for, for that um, particular element. So we've got an orange sparkler because we have calcium in it. Uh, if we go for some potassium and we need a bit of magnesium in there as well to make it burn. There we go. We get a purple sparkler. So that's that's quite neat. Right. So what we have done here is we've also created a whole load of lesson plans uh, that 10 lesson plans that are based around this world that uh, cover a whole range of chemistry, but also things like lab safety. So this is quite nice. We're quite proud to like this area. You can go in here you can speak to these folks and they'll tell you something about your lessons. And this particular lesson is about lab safety. So as you roam around this particular part of the world, you'll see bits that are very clearly unsafe and the students have to then tidy up the lab and make it safe. So we've got holes in the floor, so they're going to have to fill up those holes, obviously. Yeah, we don't want we don't want people tripping up over the holes. Yeah, so that oh, there we go. Oh, now we've got a fire burning. We're going to have to put out the fire. Oh, don't worry about the brewing stand. There we go. We can put out the fire. We've got uh, things that uh, like cobwebs in the fume hoods. They really need cleaning up. There are there's floods uh, that will need sorting out. There's uh, Bunsen burners or torches that are in places that are wholly inappropriate. Um, you'll find things in some of the chests that really shouldn't be there. Ooh, it's a chemical store, but they can go and hunt around and look for things in the chest. Oh, look, cake in the chest. That's definitely a no-no. And who's left fireworks in the lab? That's shouldn't, They shouldn't be there either. And we've got this nice little feature as well, which is a decontamination shower. Now, outside as well, we've got an area where the students can uh, can build. So we've got these, this place here where they can build different compounds. And here's an example as well. Something else we built is a periodic table. And then above the periodic table, we've put examples of things that contain these elements. So here's another new feature you can find in the Minecraft chemistry update is helium balloons. Let's try grabbing those, making those and uh, attaching them to, to pigs. That's it's quite funny to see what happens there. And so on, you've also got colored torches, um, again, following sort of the flame tests the flight um, and so on so there we go quick tour of the stuff that you can find in the new chemistry update for minecraft education edition uh, download it have fun and um and if you've got any questions about the lessons or anything else you'd like to ask us please do get in touch love to know what you think of it